Okay, this is how you add a user to your Google Analytics. Uh, and this happens sometimes when uh, you already have a Google Analytics account set up and we need to have access to it to help kind of manage some things or whatever, if you're just adding somebody so they can see stats and uh, what's happening with your website. Whatever the reason, uh, if you need to add a user to your Google Analytics, this is how we do it. When you log into your Google Analytics account at analytics.google.com, uh, you should see a home screen probably pretty similar to this. You just go over to the toolbar on the left-hand side down at the bottom and go to admin uh, with the little gear. And you should get a screen that looks something like this. Uh, and there are basically a few different levels. There's the account level, um, which uh, would be everything within your account. If you had multiple websites, uh, which uh, the separate websites that would then be listed under properties uh, for the individual websites uh, uh, that you have within your account. And it's really, it's through the account access management or the access management. Uh, and you could do that for the whole account if that's really all you have and just the one website that works best typically uh, to help manage uh, everything. But if you needed to do it, if you had multiple websites, multiple properties within your account and wanted to give access to just one, you could do it under property access management as well too. It's the same process uh, either way, uh, but I'm gonna go to account access management and uh, you open that up. And as you can see, uh, there's just a list there of uh, the accounts and you click on that blue plus sign in the top corner and say, hey, I need to add a user. Uh, and then you just type in the email address uh, and select the role uh, that they need. Uh, and um, whoever you're working with on this uh, may be able to tell you which role they need. Uh, typically, if we're working on things and uh, you know need access to, uh, to help manage and set things up, it might be an administrator level, but, uh, uh, but you know, you can change that to just viewer or whatever as needed. Uh, but once you add that email address, just click on the blue add button and that will go through. And as long as you have this checked off to notify users by email, uh, that will send them an email to um, let, notify them that they have access now. Uh, and that's it. Easy as that.